Hi, I'm Rajendra Dandukya. I'm a business mentor and leadership coach with almost 39 years of experience in pharmaceutical industry. Uh, I have been asked to share my views on how pandemic is impacting pharma promotion. I believe that every adversity brings an opportunity. And what I see is the opportunity of adaptation, learning and innovation. Now, how do you adapt? How do you learn and how do you innovate is going to really define the success of the organization. I think it is very important for every organization to early adopt, is to unlearn and relearn and also believe in incremental innovation and look for space. How do you innovate every process uh, and every aspect of uh, organization operation? Let's look at adaptability. Adaptability, we are talking about, are we wholeheartedly adapting to digital media and the virtual platforms? It is offering so much to us. What is important is an attitude to embrace it. And we need to adapt very quickly. And the organization who will quickly adapt to it will definitely have a greater momentum. The second adaptability is we are moving from coercion to facilitation. Our medical rep used to always go to a doctor and ask and demand prescription and do a little bit of pressure selling or a coercion selling in the clinic, which is now moving to facilitation. The third aspect of adaptability is focus promotion with scientific knowledge. Unless the promotion is knowledge based, it is relevant, the doctors are not going to visit again and again, either the mail, text message, audio, video, or the virtual media seminars for the organization. So it is very important that the promotion becomes more and more focused, more scientific, more relevant, what a doctor can use it. And the last is, are we bringing patient into the promotion? Are we bringing an angle of looking at the patient and how to facilitate or improve patient lives? And that probably uh, are the four areas of adaptability. The one is quickly adapt to digital media's virtual platform. Second, move from coercion to facilitation. Third, make the content very, very relevant. And fourth, look at everything from the patient point of view. Thank you.